Hey stupid, how's life? Are you getting paid enough? Hi, what's wrong? What? Did you receive your salary or something? Yep, got my first paycheck. And was wondering how much you got. <laughs> I see. It was your first month at work, right? Did you get paid enough? Of course, I have a bachelor's degree. Unlike somebody. Yeah, sure. What do you want? Don't tell me you're here just to brag. I mean, why not? Are you mad because I have a degree and I'm making more money than you? Like I care. Well, I guess you have a lot of free time. At least enough time to brag. I don't have free time unlike you. Okay, it's getting annoying. Plus, it doesn't matter whether you have a degree or not. You're just jealous because you only graduated from high school. Ah, <laughs> oh, enough. I guess there's a lot you're misunderstanding in life. You should think about your life more wisely. You finally got the chance to work. Don't waste it. I was just letting you know how much a university graduate can make. So, how much do you make? Why should I tell you? That's private. You don't want to tell because you're poor. <laughs> All that judging and stuff is annoying. Seriously. Your workplace must be lame as hell. Sure. Just so you know, I used personal connections to get this job. Hold on, what? They needed me. Maybe because I have a degree. So... I don't think that's also something to brag about. Stop envying me. <laughs> no, I'm not. What's wrong with you? Don't worry, I feel you. I know you don't get paid enough. Whatever. Are you done? I guess you learned. You're no better than me. I was always the gifted one. I don't care about any of that. Are you even working? I hear you're not doing much work. Who even told you that? Is it mom again? It's none of your business. I have a degree and a decent job. Yeah, yeah. Good for you. Just don't annoy others, alright? What? Your existence is annoying. Okay, whatever. Congrats on getting a job. Hi, Mom. I need to talk about Carol. Howdy. Everything alright? What? Is she doing something bad? She was enjoying her first real paycheck. Mom, you didn't explain her how she was able to get the job. She came to me bragging about connections or whatever. Oh no, I didn't explain much about it. I thought she wouldn't like it. So I decided not to give the details. I see. I understand. Well, you have to at some point. Her reputation at work is a disaster. You think she'll listen to me? I don't want to be involved much. I know, but... It's kind of awkward explaining it from me, right? Yeah, I guess. I do hear about her reputation, though. And she's still making fun of my career. How I never went to college. I can't tell. Well, I'll try my best to tell her. Okay? Yes, please. Or else I'll be in trouble.
Hey you. I'm working. What do you want? I see. No rest for the wicked. <laughs> and you still don't get paid enough. I'm busy, okay? Get back to work. It's very annoying. Too bad. You have more experience at work, but get paid less. If you don't stop it, you'll get what you deserve. Oh, yeah. Try me. Oh, I've had enough. What's so special about you? You're really gonna regret it. Oh, you lost your temper. Maybe because you don't have a college degree? Do you want financial support? Don't you know that I'm the CEO of the company you work at? What? I gave you a chance, and you ruined it. You are working for your sister, who you are looking down on. You were so busy bragging about your personal connections when it was me who helped you get a job. I don't understand. You, the CEO. Yes. Are you that stupid? <laughs> that can't be. This tells me you've never done research about your workplace. I thought you knew by now. That's impossible. So... I got a job because of you? Yes. Is there a problem with that? So, I'm your boss. There's a lot of problems. Why didn't you tell me? Mom didn't tell me anything. Of course she didn't. You've been looking down on me. And she knew you wouldn't want to work for me. I mean, you can't be dependent to your family anymore. Excuse me? Me? Dependent? Yes? Hello? I have a college degree. Not happening. Stop lying. Everyone knows you failed job hunting. I hope you learned your lesson. What? How do you know about that? Too bad. Literally everyone else. And so, people were asking me for help. Understood? Oh. What? You finally admit it? Are you seriously the CEO? The webpage isn't lying? And now you finally checked. I told you. Well, you know I was joking, right? What? I said I was just joking. <laughs> But you misunderstood me. Well, let's not worry about the past anymore, right? Too late. Why? It's no use trying to change sides, you know? What do you mean? You're scaring me. As I said, your reputation at work is a disaster. Why? Wait, I don't get it. Didn't I tell you a million times? To get to work. And you just wouldn't. I was trying. Trying? <laughs> Excuse me? I thought you had a college degree. Being too busy on your phone, postponing work. You never even had a thing. It's not my fault. I didn't know what to do. Who cares? We have high standards here. If you can't keep up, leave. You still don't remember why I didn't go to college? You failed the test, right? Wrong. I was already busy starting my own business. I spent time making connections, learning about business, and finally founded my own company. Do you know how much effort I put into this? Well, you never told me that. I didn't know that. Nope. You were there when I explained. Even mom told you about it too. But did you listen? But we're family, so let's just be nice to each other. Huh? 
You're my sister! You can make me vice president. You still don't get my point. You're fired. What? Me? Fired? You're talking about promotion, right? You think I'm joking? I envy your positivity. But that ends today. What do you mean? You should feel sorry for mom. She gave you all the support to help you out. At home and at work. But she won't be supporting you anymore. What? I still live with her. That can't happen. Well, not anymore. Just go find a job and a place to stay. I don't have the money for a house. And I'm tired of job hunting. Do I care? There's no choice. You're fired. It's your company, right? Can't you do something about it? Nope. We decided your dismissal at today's meeting. What meeting? That's why I've been busy recently. I've been running around, apologizing about my useless sister, because it was my responsibility. Useless? Yes! You're too busy being proud about your degree. No one cares! Come on, you're my sister! You don't have to go hard on me, you know? Please, don't leave me. You get what you get. You can't do this to me! Yes, I can. You're useless, rude, and don't have any common sense. We don't need people like you at our company. Come on, start being independent. You have a college degree, right? After all, Carol got fired. And her parents finally kicked her out of the house. So she doesn't have a place to stay or work. With no choice, she started job hunting again. But who would want to hire her? She ended up working part-time with a lot of high school students around her and currently lives in the cheapest apartment you can find in the neighborhood. Rumor has it that she is having a hard time working with students and living in a cheap apartment. Carol's sister was the opposite. After firing her sister at work, and kicking her out of her parents' house. She was living a peaceful life. And unlike Carol's situation, her company is on the road to success.